Yes lads, welcome back to another training video on the channel. So we saw two pod buds of Gomez and Amendi. Now Gomez and Amendi we picked up in the last video. Um we actually lost out two hundred coins on this Gomez, but we actually made about two and a half, about two two seven, maybe three K on this Mendy, which is not bad. Costa we just sold who was in the club. He was in my uh team, but then we obviously got Coman, so we didn't need him. Yeah, and Pobbers we we probably made about twenty K on these four players, well three players because we lost out on Gomez, but get rid of them uh, and then we've just bought a few hurricanes just because i think he's going to go up throughout the next week or so um going into fever with the new promo and everything so i'm just going to probably pick up some spc fodder um i think that's probably a good shout out to do i think fodder is going to be really good next upcoming days what i'm going to do is i'm going to get on with some trading and show you exactly everyone that i pick up and everyone that i sell and the exact profit that we make so Starting off with two million five hundred eight thousand nine hundred and twenty. Let's just say, let's, you know, for the sake of it, just say five hundred and nine thousand. Um, so we we'll start off with five hundred nine thousand. The way we can end up within about an hour. Um, there's no point in me saying to you that you can make this and that amount of coins, you know, within an hour if I'm not even doing it myself. That's just complete, you know, pointless. I don't get when people say you can make two hundred k a day and they don't even make two hundred k a day. But they're saying you know you can make 500k a week and they're not even on 500,000 coins yeah that's a bit pointless for me so i'm gonna jump in get on with it and um i'll show you everyone that i pick up and uh yeah i'll bring you back on the first play okay i bet you we get outbidded oh my god we didn't get outbidded so i've been on here for like 10 minutes now and this is the first player i've picked up everyone has been outbidding me on everything okay now so we picked up a few more players we have picked up four Andrew Robinsons. Now, this is his cheapest with a shadow on. I'm just seeing if that sells or not. Uh, we've got him for 24, 24, 23, and 24. Now, that's a good one. I mean, that's going to be about 400 something coins because he's about 25, 750. I've put these up and we're on to the next layer. So, with a shadow on, we're looking at like what, 26, about 26.5, right? Okay, I'll bring you back. Okay, so I'm going to show you live kind of what I do um, and how I get actually so many cards. So, Andrew Robertson actually is quite a good one to do. Now, 24k is going to be about 700. If we're selling for 26, we're actually selling for 26,250, which I think is going to be about nine. Yes, yeah, 938 coins a card. It's actually not that bad, right? It doesn't look that good. Now, if you're picking up a few of them, it's actually not, not so bad. I'm going to leave that one alone. Um, but you got this one for 19, and I'm just going across probably up to about two to three minutes because. Don't want to go too far where his price is going to change like quite dramatic in that time it can change i mean it can go down three or four k it can go down two or one k and that's going to be a profit or it can actually go up and benefit you but for the sake of the risk i'm actually not going to go that far unless it's going to have like 18k or something on it and i know i'm going to be all right let's have a look so like that one there so, um i'm all right for bidding like 21k on it uh and then i'm going to go ahead and look at some more players so when they're actually on the watch list i can go ahead and look look for some more players um, that one went for twenty four two fifty, which is the best. That one we can actually go for twenty four. That's not bad. Then we've got this one again. We can watch out on this one as well. Yeah, it'd be interesting to see if we can get him. That one is actually just sold now. We did get that one for twenty four. So I'm actually going to wait for his price to change now. Um, I might put this one up for twenty six thousand. Try and get about seven hundred coins profit on him, uh, which I'm going to do now. I could wait to see if mine sell and then put maybe put them up, but his price could change in that amount of time. So if mine aren't selling yet, I'm actually going to go ahead and put this up for 26. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and move on to another player now because uh, I don't want to put all my coins in the Robinson just in case you know we don't get anywhere with him. Um, that would be nice if we can get him for 23.5. So um, FIFA decided to update halfway through the video. Um, and yeah, this has been like 40 minutes now. It's actually going quite quick at the moment. Um, but I thought I didn't know what was happening. It wouldn't let me on to the actual game And then I checked for updates like half an hour later and yeah, there was an update there. So um, If I bring you over to here Looking at some Handanovic's now he's up. He's about 32 750 uh, 32 there that one's actually sold. I think that one's probably gonna be sold We've Got 32 750 as you can see here. I've actually picked one up um, I went for 31 that's that's actually quite bad uh, if we go to home, I think he's here. Yeah, we want for thirty thousand five hundred. This is going to be about six hundred, um, six hundred and thirteen coins profit. So thirty two seven fifty, and you've got thirty two five hundred. 
That should be a little bit of profit. Okay, so we've just got on. Um, just got back on. Go and have a look. So we did have some bids going on. Now, whether we've got these bids or not. We went for 28k. That's actually not bad. That went for 32. We're watching these ones. And Danovic, I believe, is still 32,750. So I'm actually going to go... Th no, 32... Yeah, 32,750. A bit of profit in them. That's not actually not that bad. Um, 30... 32,750. I mean, that that's going to be like... What? Like 300 and something coins profit. That's not really that. I mean, that's kind of pointless. But this one's a lot better. So this will make up for it. I kind of just done it just so it's another player to trade with. Um... An extra bit of coins. I know I can make coins on it, so why not, right? Um, but watch them. They've got a couple of minutes on them left. We bought them for twenty. Oh, actually, we bought them for twenty-three. So that's actually not bad. So we're still going to make a thousand coins on that card. Just shy a thousand. Uh, just it's going to be nine hundred and seventy-five coins. Not bad. I'll take that. That's not bad. We could have made a little bit more money, but unfortunately, we didn't. So we have another. I mean, we're watching a few now, right? So because they look like they're coming in quite cool. So um. Yeah, they're coming in quite easy to be fair. So we've got another one for twenty eight two fifty now. If we're selling them for what is it? It's thirty two seven fifty, right? We're actually getting thirty one thousand back, so thirty one thousand one. So it's gonna be nearly three K on this card, which is actually quite cool, isn't it? Um not actually bad. I'll take three K on the card. Okay lads, uh Han Danovich is actually coming quite quicker than I thought, so I actually had to just stay and try and get these. So we've got that one for twenty, I think. This one for 30k, which is going to be 1,100 coins profit, which ain't bad. Um, I'm going to go and list that one up. Happy days with that. This one we've got for 26k, which is quite nice. This is why I did in, especially goalkeepers. So overlooked goalkeepers. Um, 32,750 there. We're going to just put them all up. We're going to put three up. Once they sell, I'm going to put the others up. Well, the other one I've got. Um, one, two, three. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Lads, we've got a Ling Lei, I think. I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna put Handanovic up at the same time. Yeah, we've got a Ling Lei for 15,250. We get 15,913 back, so um, we'll probably be on the lookout for like what? 610 coins profit, not the best, but uh, it will do. It will do. And then um, get this card up for 32,750. 32, I mean, yeah, because he ends up to 35 a lot. Goes up to 35k. I mean, that's going to be what, five, 750. I mean, 36k, probably where you're looking at, and then you're probably looking at like nearly 2k a card there. So, um, not bad at all. If he does go up, I mean, I can imagine he's going to go up at some point, right? I'm probably not going to lose coins on that hurricane. I mean, the longer I keep him, I mean, he's just going to go up. Uh, I can't imagine him going down anytime soon. 33, I mean, that. 32750. I'm just gonna buy that one as well. Um, this is that's the only, the only thing is that's just gonna ruin me for the profit that we've made for the video. But I will work it out and um, I will work it out and see what we've um, what we made. So okay, we're looking at Casemiro now. We picked up one for forty thousand seven hundred fifty. He's actually selling for forty forty five thousand seven hundred fifty, which is forty three thousand four hundred after tax. That's actually a nice bit of profit on him. We're trying to get a few more here. Um, that would be about 2,400 uh, after tax. As you can see, 45 there. Um, 45, 750. You got 45. Probably looking at there was three for 46. Um, there's more now. So you're looking at about 45, 750 still. I'm actually going to go and put this one up quickly. For, yeah, 45, 750. Um, 45, 750. Now, obviously, I think a lot of people are going to go and do the Jao Felix SPC. So, I think this is why they've gone up a little bit more. Casemiro's and things like that. Um, that is still profit. So, I'm still going to bid on this. Um, be interesting to see if we can get this one as well. What I'll do is I'll bring it back if we do get them. Um, and yeah, we'll go from there. Okay, so that's getting too close for comfort. We could probably make 400 coins on that card. They've got them for 43, but I'm going to get out on that. This one will give us 1,463 uh, after tax, which is not bad. Um, yeah, I mean, it's it's not so bad. We're not getting outbidded constantly now like we were. Um, we'll carry on and see if we can um, make some coins. So we're looking at 42. Yeah, I'll take that one, and I'll take that one as well. Oh, we've missed out on that one. That's a shame. So again, we can go and put this up for... 
50. And that's going to be just shy of a thousand coins profit there. It's going to be just shy of it. So that's, that's nice. Yeah, so I'm not sure how long this video is going to plan out, but I'm going to end it here and I'm just we are just going to go through exactly everyone we sold and actually how many coins we made down to the penny. So I worked out the kings we bought, it's like 97,000 something on king, I forgot what it was. But with the money we've got now and the first clip I've just seen of how much we started with, which was 2,508,000 uh, and 800 and something, 900 and something. We've actually made 28,535,000 uh, 28, coins. 28,535 coins, yeah. So, actually bad. It's not bad. We were on it for about an hour, so it's probably about 30k an hour. We did actually get um, we did get kicked off for the update as well. Uh, but an hour actually solid trading. I uh, know yeah, it's quite easy to, uh, to be fair. And then Hurricanes, obviously, we're just going to try and, and um, try and get a good price for him at some point. Um. SPC follow is probably where you're looking at, but yeah, this is just kind of me showing you. It is quite easy. There's no like Pacific player that you can make thirty thousand coins on, right? Um, thirty thousand k an hour. It's actually not thirty k an hour. It's actually not bad. Um, just simple trading. All I've kind of been doing. I, I mean, I just showed you the players I picked up, but what I was just doing is coming on here and just until I find a bid. I've told you this numerous times before. Hundred three thousand for Bruno. I add him. I go and see um what he's going for. I'm just gonna have a look at Bruno. Uh this might not work. This uh this might work. So it's just one of them ones. Uh and then he's like what? Hundred in hundred that hundred in no oh, actually, what is it? Hundred and thirteen? Right, it's about hundred and ten thousand coins then. So you know it's gonna be about six thousand coins. Um it's gonna be about six thousand twelve. Um seven. You need them for about yeah. The hundred and eleven. We're gonna have a look at what that bid was. That's got 107, so it's actually not that bad. But I'd compare its price 105 there. Then the same for 110,000. We'll actually work out what it is. Uh, 111. There's actually 105k you need them for. So you can probably try and snap that card for 105k or something like that. But yeah, that, I mean, that's the gist of it, right? That's kind of what you do. That's kind of how I do it. And I'd watch a few at a time and go on to the next plan of things that I. Uh, yeah, that's kind of it. So yeah, twenty. What was it? Twenty-eight thousand five hundred thirty-five coins in an hour. It's not actually that bad, considering we're just basically just trading and flipping straight away. It's not. It's not the worst. Uh, if we waited on a few of these players, we could probably make a little bit more money, uh, especially with the poppers and that we had earlier. Casemiro, I think this Casemiro is quite at its highest at the moment. I can't imagine that card. I mean, that card could top up a bit more. I suppose he is. He is flying up. Uh, and then eighty-eight, like Handanovic and that. They're actually. Um, it's actually quite cheap at the moment for an 88 and you've got Harry Kane getting cheaper so I recommend looking at them um, you ain't going to lose coins on these kind of SPC followers because they're always going to be worth something right something's always going to put the price up on them because at the end of the day when EA aren't doing anything there's no promo packs out they're going to bring out SPCs right and then if there's nothing to be packed in people are going to out and they're not going to be opening packs they're going to be buying these kind of cards to put into SPCs and then that's when these cards start rising up so yeah, look out for cards like that. I think uh, you'll they do well for you. Um, I'm gonna go and pick up a few Harry Canes. I think a few more, maybe uh, a few more SBC fodder. That's gonna be it for the video, guys. Hope you enjoyed. If you did last this long, leave a comment down below saying you watched majority of the video. Uh, thumbs up to that. Appreciate that a lot. Subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.